Vision is behind the making of runners. Praise the Lord. Welcome to the very first day of the month of June 2024. So we are stepping in to uh, the last, very last month of the first half of the year 2024. And without a shadow of a doubt, God's blessings will be unleashed upon you in the name of Jesus. Um, today is June 1st, 2024. And our topic is, you are not killable. The Bible says, I shall not die, but live and declare the works of the Lord. Psalm 118 verse 17, thought for the day, you cannot be killed by anything or anyone because you are not killable. Once again, you're welcome to the sixth month of our year of above only existence. God shall perfect all that concerns us in this season in Jesus name. Now, while in the fifth year of the medical school, God's servant did a project on culturing of microbes from different places. His group was asked to go to restaurants and take culture from plates that had already been washed and from food that was already prepared. And that was what they did. Then they took the samples that they had taken to the laboratory and checked it. Surprisingly, they found all manner of bacteria, but they found a particular one, a bacteria called Staphylococcus, inside a clean plate that had been washed in a market restaurant. And they also found it in the food. This type of Staphylococcus Fecalis is the type that is found in feces and here it was found in food that was served and in a clean plate. They couldn't believe what they saw. He believes that God knows all these things. This could have been the reason why Mark 16, 18 says, and if they drink any deadly thing, it shall not hurt them. This means God will preserve you from the effect of whatever deadly poison you ate unawares. It is only in heaven you would know all the things that God delivered you from that you are not aware of. It is only in heaven you will know all the things that the devil planned against you that did not come to pass. Beloved, you must understand that we live by faith. We survive in the world by faith. Even if you enter a taxi, and the driver is an occultic man. He can't kill you because you are not easily killable. And if he tries to cause an accident, he will be the one that will die and suck his own blood, not yours. Psalm 118 verse 17 says, you shall not die but live and declare the works of the Lord. You must believe that the promises of God in his word for your life are real. Believe that you cannot be killed by anything or by anyone because you are not killable. Remember this, you cannot be killed by anything or anyone because you are not easily killable. What's our assignment today? Number one, always move and act with the mentality that you are not killable. No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. And number two, believe God's word and God's verdict for your life. Praise the Lord. Let us pray. Say after me, Lord, Thank you for the covenant of life and peace in your word concerning my life. I decree that I shall not die, but live to fulfill your purpose for my life, O oh Lord, in Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I'd like to pray for you today. You are not in Christ. You are not born again. You don't have this kind of guarantee that we're talking about. And you want to have it today? Simply pray this afternoon. Say, Lord Jesus, thank you for dying for my sins. I know I'm a sinner. I need your help. Please come into my life. Be the Lord of my life. Wash away all my sins. Make me a new person. From today, I turn my back on sin. I live to please you all. In Jesus' name. Amen. Praise the Lord. And I want to close by wishing you a happy birthday. It's your birthday today, the very first day of June. Every year is your special day. And my prayer for you is that God will cause you to experience His goodness, His faithfulness, His loving kindness on all sides in your life. In Jesus' name. 
Hallelujah. God bless you. Happy birthday. And please don't forget to be up to date with your Bible reading. Be up to date and let God help you as you glean insights and revelations that will help you to live the fulfilled life. In Jesus' name, God bless you. Peace.